hello and welcome back so now we will create a script for our health bar so whenever we take damage we will gradually decrease our health so in order to do that in the script folder we need to click on create then c sharp script and let's name this as health bar let's attach the script to our health bar game object so we will simply drag and drop it now let's open up the script inside the script we will be interacting with the ui so make sure right here at the top you type using unity engine dot ui and after that we don't need these two default functions so we will simply remove them and then at the top we need a reference to our slider so we will say public slider and we will name this as health bar slider and by using this health bar slider we will increase and decrease our health now after this we need to create a function for setting up our health so right here we will say public void and we will name this function as set health and in here let's pass a load by name of health in here we will say help our slider dot value and the help our slider dot value will be equals to the health value now just save this get back to the unity click on the health right here we need to provide our slider so we can actually try and drop that in there so whenever we call this set health function our help our script will search for the slider okay which we assign right here and it will simply adjust the value of the slider so for example if the enemy hit us it will decrease the health like this okay so now after this we want a function to set our full health when we start the game okay we can't do this from the inspector again and again okay we want a function for that so right here let's create a public void we will name this as give full health and in here we will pass a float by the name of health and then we will say help our slider dot max value and it will be equals to the health and also we will say help our slider dot value equals to health so actually we will set the max value of this health bar to our health which will be 120 and also we will set this value to 120 as well so when we start the game it will be 120 and right here the value will be as well 120 so with this our help bar is now ready to be used so now we will simply attach this help bar to our player now what we need to do we need to open up this player script and inside the script we need a reference to our health bar so right here in the player health thing we will say public health bar and let's name this as health bar as well let's make the p capital and then right here in the start function when the game start we want to give the player the full health so as you know we have a function for that which is give full health so right here in the start we will say health bar and let's call the function which is give full health and right here we want to give the player health so now let me tell you the logic behind this as you can see we have these two variable which is player health and then present health so the player health is 120 and when the game start we set the present health to the player health so now the present health is 120 
and to the health bar we have assigned the player health which is 120 so when the game starts this max value will be set to 120 and this value as well so it will be set to 120 and then it will decrease in according to the max value so now let's decrease our health and where we want to decrease our health it will be inside this player hit damage so whenever we take damage from the enemy we will say health bar dot set health and this is basically this function which is set health in which we decrease or we can increase our health bar okay so as you can see we set the value to the health so now we need to pass a health variable and right here now we want to pass the present health okay so if the present health is 100 then the value will be 100 if it is 90 then the slider value will be 90 and like that it will gradually decrease so now we can just save this and now click on the player we need to assign the health bar there so simply drag and drop the health bar there and if you click on the health bar okay we have already assigned the slider so we can actually drag and drop that like that okay now let's just quickly start the game and let's test it out let's get closer to the enemy and now as you can see as the uh, enemy shooters as you can see our health decreases and let's the drone come closer to us okay now we are dead and let me show you the value for this health bar as well as you can see it is now set to one okay let's play the game in this small window let me lock the cursor let's run towards the now as you can see the max value is set to 120 and also the value becomes set to 120 as i told you so now our health is 80 now 75 and like that it will decrease now let's run away from the enemy okay and as you can see our health bar is now like that whoops our enemy just got stuck in, the, in those pipes okay so now as you can see our health bar works just fine we have now a fully functional health bar and in the next video we will add this health bar to our enemies so then whenever we hit our enemy the enemy health will decrease so let's end this video right here